Alright, what's up? I'm gonna review the latest vegan what I eat in a day video by Holly Gabriel. Anemic and emaciated. Hey guys, it's Wednesday, so it's like day three kind of in New York. We didn't really have all of Monday, but we are trying to find Absolutely anorexic looking. Especially the eyes. I think they do like this is malnutrition. Is something I've been craving Damn. since we have been here. Oh yes, this looks my vibe. Pure kitchen, vegan friendly. And then we're getting like superfood lattes. I'm getting this protein one with the like protein and then like almond butter and banana. Yeah, so as I said, we ordered these superfood lattes as well. It's crazy that sick so people like this can make videos on YouTube and encourage others to eat that way. Well, but we'll get something else. She's feeling a bit sorry for herself because she's a bit cold now. So she's going to get a bit upset on you. Really cold, cold. Yeah, she's just not used to this. She's not eating instant buns, so she's not happy. Emily, are you happy? I'm loving. Stop lying. Well. This is just isn't mum's type of breakfast. I need loads of bread. Yes. It's an anti-human breakfast. Uh -huh. That's why. Fine. All she had was anti-nutrients and sugar. Above ground. There's some really weird music playing when you're walking around this highway walk, high line walk. Mum wished that she, she seems absolutely out of breath. Quite sunny. Her and slow way of talking makes her seem child. retarded. I don't say that to offend her, she just seems <laughs> retarded. That's what I would think if I would see her in real life. <laughs> She's trying to do some ballet. Here we go. Forward stretch, mom. <laughs> mom. <laughs> so much green. I didn't expect there to be so much green. It reminds me of the Eden Project. Eat it. It's in the middle of New York. I like these plants. A different, different. arm color. <laughs> <laughs> and we're apparently related. Check out my leg color. Yeah, but I do lots of gardening. She does not. I do so much gardening. I'm always so cutting awesome. twigs. Whoa. There's nothing to laugh about. She can't get a tan. That's because of her deficiencies. She's not producing any vitamin D. This is why it's irrelevant for vegans to be in the sun, seeing as they don't have enough cholesterol to make any of the hormones. It's so cool. Village natural. It's not completely vegan, but it has vegan options. Oh my god, all this natural. <laughs> my yes. Turn your wrap round. Look at that wrap, that aesthetic. What the fuck is natural about that? Wrap, look at this is a, a black bean burrito inside. Mm. That guac. I just mm. opened my burrito. This guacamole is so good. And mum is sharing my salsa. Oh, guacamole, isn't it? Guacamole. Typical slave meal. Grains, grains, and grains. That's all that they eat. <laughs> the people in power want you to eat seeds, and the vegans fall for it more than anybody else. Avocado and the guacamole, some oils, that's about it. No vitamins, no micronutrients at all. You would think that you would get some minerals out of it, but seeing as most of the meals are based on grains, they don't get anything because all seeds have anti-nutrients. Yes, grains are seeds. Guacamole. I think it's guacamole. Mm -hmm. Guacamole? Mm -hmm. Alright, So we're just currently in a bit of hysteria because kind of semi tired. I'm just finding everything really funny. We ordered desserts from this place, which is actually really good. The food is like really nice. What exactly did you do that made you tired? I mean, it's got that the home cooked Walk food a little like. bit. <laughs> so I went for an apple and blueberry pie. I am such an apple crumble pie person. It's a baby pineapple! We're at Columbus Circle. We just got the subway again. And we're now going to the Lincoln Center. I don't know where we're going. What the fuck is wrong with her speech? She's dying in front of everybody's eyes. So we just casually walked into like a private Do her viewers not see it? Everyone's in fancy dresses. Probably not because they're vegan themselves. We're also trying to get mum on kombucha. She's on it. That produces adrenaline. Not yeah, healthy. I've got a really green one. But we had a bit of a mess because they fizzed up and they went like everywhere. Very light. Can we tip it again? 
Damn, she looks so sick. <laughs> I can't even do. I'm gonna be terminally ill. So, as I said on Wednesday evening, we didn't really eat much because we were pretty full. But the next day, obviously, we started out with breakfast and we just went to. It wasn't a prep, but I can't remember what it was called. Um, there were quite a few of them, I assume they were a chain. And we each got a pot of fruit and I got this chia pudding thing with some granola on the top. It was really, really good. Just Obviously, a bunch of I sugar, my no micronutrients. Again, thing, we're gonna get lunch. I'm starving. Mother vegan. It was the first As place always, we came to. And you can't so do a good. vegan what so I eat on the video without and saying I'm starving. I haven't had a burger yet in New York. Because all of them do that. Do that. So we're going for our classic burger with fries. Fake meat? In terms of food recommendations, I would highly what recommend the fuck the any of the places we Grains go to all day long. Walk. But on the top of your list, please put Mother Vegan. It's right off Times Square and the food is honestly insane. So this is Beyond Meat. Right. That is so weird. And then we just finished off by getting some of their cookies to try, which were again super good. What did you say? Alright, just so you understand. Clearly, as you can see, she's starving. She said it herself. She looks incredibly sick. And this is why vegans start eating fake meat. In their mentally ill head, it's the same, maybe even better, even though it doesn't have over 50 nutrients which you would actually get from meat. But somehow they try to make themselves believe that they just ate meat and that they got everything that they needed. It's a, a very severe mental illness. Wait. Wait. Bye, New York! Long seven hour flight across the Atlantic. I did have coke, which is something I have not drunk in such a long time. But as you can clearly see, the jet chocolate really also hit me at this point. I'm more adrenaline from the I coke also, of course. Already. All right, this is a prime example of what veganism does to younger women. She didn't get over fifty nutrients, as always. Vegans don't get them because they're not found in plants. This is why she looks the way she looks. This is why her speech is slurred. Thanks for watching, guys.